Hello and welcome. Last two episodes was about how to reach Bali, flight details, basic information and all about our private villa in Ubud. Hope you liked it. Also we went to Tagalalang Rice Terrace, visited Ala Sarum Bali and did the Bali Super Extreme Swing and shared details about our experience. If you haven't watched that then do watch that first. I'm leaving a card at the top. Beginning today's episode. Now we are heading to Pura Tirtha Temple. It's a Balinese temple famous for its holy spring water where Hindus go for ritual purification. The sarong is mandatory before entering any Balinese temple and it's free of cost. We have come here at Pushti Temple Temple. Uh, we wore the sarong because we will take a bath in the holy water spring. And uh, so we have to wear the sarong for that. So we are all ready. You will get this sarong from the counter which you have seen in the back. From there you can rent your uh, sarong and also a locker if you need. The sarong rent for me and Koshik is 35,000 idea and locker 15,000 idea that is separate. This green sarong that you see everyone wearing is chargeable as I said. There are separate changing rooms for men and women. It's mandatory to change into sarong before taking this holy bath. Every water spring has a different meaning for health, success, money etc. as told by our guide. It's a belief that the bathing in the holy water cleanses the soul. This, uh, this is different, different uh, like the ceremony. Mm. And there also different, and there different. Like mm -hmm. it. <coughs> uh, I call in the there, I call it, call it in Bali, macharu. Macharu, mm -hmm. same like the, from the chicken, only skin. Mm. And the meat, not only skin, yeah? only skin. And the symbol is also like this, the new banana, the new banana, the symbol is for the all people, all tray for the growing. Wow. Uh, and the queen one for the holy spring. Wow. He was explaining us about the ceremony which is performed every day. Apparently, it's a belief by the locals that if the water dries here, then Bali will perish. This for the coconut, stimulus, and the special for the, like I call it in Bali, taksu. Taksu same like the for the intellect, maybe like the yoga for spiritual is very good one. Also the penis for the frying for the ceremony mm. in Bali I making coconut milk and coconut oil. Okay. Uh, because in Bali not drink milk from the animal mm. from the cow. Mm. We took a temple tour. At the exit, there's a big pool where tourists can feed the fishes. We did the same. At the end, we had to submit the sarongs back to the temple counter. After exiting, we saw a market just at the exit gate, did some shopping as I found it cheaper than Ubud market.
What's your name? Ini kena ada ni. Allah. Allah. Angga. Angga. So just completed the third temple tour. Now we will be heading towards another part. And uh, this is our friend yes, from man. Bali. Yes, Koman. He, My name is Koman. His name is Koman. Whenever you come to Bali, please contact him because he is the loveliest and the most innocent person I've ever seen. He will give you a complete tour of the different places. Whenever you come to Tirtha Temple, you need someone to guide you, right? So he is the person yes. who will help you in that. And uh, in the morning, what happened? We lost our way somewhere middle in the rice terrace. So he was the one who took us from there and then showed us all the way along the photo stops everything yes. and uh, now uh, it's time to say him goodbye but I'll leave his phone number yes. in the description box below please check that whenever you come to Bali you can contact him his name is Koman a yes, very Koman. good and lovely person yes please come to Bali Right now enjoying lunch at the Legend Cafe which is situated in the Uban market. So today's day till now was beyond my expectations. Did a lot of activities. We'll be sharing all those videos. Please do visit my channel. You'll feel like amazing by seeing those. And uh, just now we completed our tour from Tirtha Temple. So here we have headed to come to have lunch and just look at my plate. So much of delicious sometimes lunch. This uh, is a traditional Balinese food. Guys, do uh, taste the traditional Balinese food whenever you come to Bali. So, I am having this Nasi Ayam Bali. Now, let's see how is the taste, but it looks delicious. So, this food is the legend crispy duck. This food is uh, the traditional Balinese food and it's quite famous in Bali. Whenever you come to Bali, please try this. We haven't tried it yet. After trying, we will we can tell you how it tastes. But it, it looks huge and something quite special. And after having our lunch, we will be going to the sacred monkey forest. But before that, let's have this. This is the entrance of the monkey forest. Now we will book the tickets and get inside. Come. It's a huge area and takes almost more than an hour to see the entire place. So plan accordingly. It has over 1000 monkeys and 3 temples. The place is maintained and managed very well as they take proper care and precautions in keeping the place sacred. It's a famous tourist attraction in Ubud and a must visit. So now as we are entering the monkey forest area, we will be seeing some wild notorious monkeys doing all kind of notorious spooky activities. So super excited to see those and uh, our the ticket price was 80 IDR for, per, uh, for single person and the timings are from morning 8 o'clock till uh, evening 6 o'clock. Monkey selfie over here? Yes, yes, So just now book two tickets for me and for Kaushik to get a selfie with the monkey. The name of this place is actually Sacred Monkey Forex Sanctuary. Uh, as you can see everywhere there is greenery. They try to conserve their ecosystem like they are mainly focusing on that. So without disturbing the natural habitat of the monkeys and also of the forest, they are promoting the tourism over here. monkey forest there are few points which you should take note of it's written over here 
first point is do not make any contact with the monkey like eye to eye contact do not make with them do not carry any loose bag over here and then do not try to disturb them basically and also do not try to give them any snacks or any kind of food otherwise you will be in danger So guys enjoying the monkey forest this whole monkey forest sanctuary it takes around 2 hours to complete this tour our it's done now we will be exiting and uh, over here there are many toilets and many basins also where you can wash your hands whenever you come to bali don't forget to bring a mosquito repellent with you we got this from the airport because in this forest there are lots of mosquitoes Ended the night with a wholesome dinner at a restaurant in Ubud Market. Leave a comment if you like this vlog, share it, and subscribe our channel. And don't forget to hit the bell icon for notifications. See you again in the next part. Till then, keep watching and take care. Bye bye.